What's good, creative fam? It's your boy, Just Be Wise. And today, we're going to talk about Instagram, but you already know that because you saw the thumbnail and the title. So, okay, so before we can actually discuss how to export with the best settings, we need to figure out what does Instagram actually say you should be uploading your photos and videos or whatever as. So let's go ahead and hop in and check out to see what Instagram actually says you're allowed to do. All right, so if I'm good at this editing thing, I'll put this up on the screen, but essentially what it says here is when you share a photo that has a width between 320 to 1080 pixels, we keep the photo at its original resolution. As long as the aspect ratio is between 1.91 to one and four, to five what the heck does all that mean essentially what all that means is you got three aspect ratios you can use and they can be as wide as 1080 right so we know we got the 1.91 to 1 which should be 1080 to 560 i would advise don't use that then you got the one to one which should be 1080 to 1080 and then the more preferably preferably the one that you should prefer to use, which is the four to five, which is 1080 to 350. Now doing this is gonna help to avoid a lot of the compression that you're gonna get from Instagram. Now there's no way to completely avoid Instagram's compression, but this is gonna help you out a lot. So we're gonna show you how to do that in Lightroom. And then I'm also gonna show you how to do that in Photoshop. All right, so let's go ahead and open up Lightroom. All right, so the first thing we're gonna need to do is crop this image down so we're gonna need to crop and as you see lightroom already has the one by one and the four by five as an option so i would use one of those depending on your image let's say for this one right now we're gonna use the four by five we'll do the one by one in photoshop or maybe after this i don't know they're both quick and easy to do we're gonna crop it to our liking now since this has been cropped in four by five and we're just gonna go straight ahead and export. Let's right click, export. Now, when you get to the export settings, you do JPEG, dimensions, you wanna make sure you do custom, right? We're gonna do custom. And now, here in the long side, the long side refers to the longest side. So here the height is the longest side. So you wanna make that at 1350. It's automatically gonna do the math for you and put the width at 1080. What's important here is to make sure that the width on all of your images are 1080 so it doesn't get reduced. Easy as that. That's it. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Now let's go back. We're actually gonna use this same reference and we'll do a one by one. All right, do one by one. Crop this bad boy like this, bam, bam. Export, same dealy. You wanna make sure now your long slide needs to be 1080. And the long side is gonna actually be exactly the same as the other side, cause it's a one-to-one. -one. So again, making sure that you have that thing at 1080 and you're good to go. Let's check it out in Photoshop. Okay, so now we have Photoshop up and ready so let's go ahead and crop this image four by five wham bam thank you ma'am crop that bad boy like that let's go ahead and file export export as hold on and populate it on the other screen here you go Okay, so as you can see here, my size of the image is 4,000 by 5,000, which is way too big. And Instagram will have a field day making this thing super small. So what we're gonna do is just come right over here. We're gonna take the width, because that's what's important per Instagram. Put that in at 1080. Again, Photoshop is gonna do the math for you. And it's gonna bring down to 1350 then you're good you can just export nothing fancy here you have to do that's all we got for this super short video if you have any additional tips on how to help avoid instagram's 
compression or just how to post that heat on Instagram, please leave it in the comment section below. If you like the video, please like the video. And if you're new to the family, go ahead and sub down below. And as always, I gave you some tools to create. Now be great. Peace.